Hi Aries and welcome to your daily reading. I hope you guys are doing fantastic. Thank you for stopping in. Okay, let's see what we're getting here for you Aries. The Ace of Coin, a new development, a gift, a new opportunity. The Devil. Okay, so there could be something here. The challenge is a limitation. Somebody has all the power. Capricorn energy. It could also be you're very excited. You're anticipating this. Past energy, Ten of Wands. A lot of pressure. Or you're doing something all on your own. Four of Cups. the death okay so you have a change coming in you're changing your life from something here that may have been toxic that you didn't really care for Queen of Pentacles the King of Pentacles You want to stand your ground with something, you're holding back. The sun is shining on something here. <laughs> and then we have the tower. So we have a shock or a surprise about a change. Um, something is being given to you. What is the tower here? The king of cups, Pisces, Cancer. Scorpio energy. What do, okay, we have a, a emotional maturity. What do we have here with the death card? What is changing? Strength. Okay, there's something about courage and strength. Okay, something is you're not, you're refusing to quit, refusing to give up. You're very persistent. Wow, Ten of Swords. There is something that is the end of a stressful situation. All right. There is something that you're very excited about that is being given to you where the challenge is that somehow, some way, You don't have full control over the situation, but it's like you don't really care if you don't have full control. You just want this anyway, and you're very excited about it. You've already made up your mind about it. So the death comes in changing a situation. There's a, a divine match here, king and queen of the coins. Somebody is being aggressive or defensive, um, and then the other energy is holding back, with withholding or cutting off the sun, the tower, the king of the water. Something is coming to light about somebody's deep feelings. Okay. So, we have the King of the Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, a communication where a decision is made. The Hermit card, somebody shares wisdom with you. Um, there could be something about a Virgo. Somebody shines the light of wisdom on something. The lovers. Choices. In your love life, there could be something about a choice in someone's love life. And Five of Swords, wow. Somebody feels bitter, resentful. Um, somebody feels kind of bitter or resentful in a situation. 
They could feel jealous. The challenge is the devil. Somebody is kind of toxic here. It looks like you're determined. You've made up your mind to go in a new direction. And somebody comes forward and tells you how they feel about you with the king of water. So who or what is this king of water? Three of cups, okay. Celebration, good times, fun, happiness, two of pentacles. Somebody is juggling, trying to manage multiple things. Um, shared feelings, negotiation, compromise. Okay, so there is something here disruptive. The tower brings in a king of the water. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, a Knight of Cups. Somebody brings in feelings. They express their feelings with the Knight of Cups. The Queen of Wands. This is you probably feeling pretty confident in yourself. Sorry guys. Okay, so what is coming in? King of Wands, it's a, a match. Someone is a, a match to your energy. Fiery, passionate, creative. Four of Wands, there's definitely some kind of match. Couple. There's some energy of communication coming in quickly. Page of the coin, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. There's a sense of urgency. There's fire energy wanting to do something right away. The nine of coin. Somebody is independent. They're doing things on their own two feet. They are looking out for themselves. They're having a comfortable life on their own. And what have we got here? Okay, let's see. What is this Nine of Pentacles? Page of Cups. Water sign or somebody reaching out to you with a friendly, fun message. So it looks like here something is being offered to you. You're very excited. There is this gift coming in, six of coin. But for some reason, on your mind is four of cups, like I'd rather pass. Um, somebody could be very, very excited going forward fast and you're four of swords where, or somebody else is four of swords. Like, I don't wanna talk. But then somebody here gives someone this gift, this opportunity um, to elevate. Somebody's being elevated. It clo it's a permanent change. There's something that requires courage, compromise, negotiation, a willing to um, willing to compromise. There is a very successful energy here coming in. Your energy, Aries, is queen of coin. You're practical. You have money. You have a match here as well. And then you want to be brave. There's an energy of withholding. Somebody, there's some illumination or something is brought to light about somebody's deep feelings. Probably for you. Three of Cups is here, wanting to have a reunion, wanting to see you, wanting to get together because there's this Knight of Cups. Your energy, I feel, 
is Queen of Wands, King of Wands. This could be a creative match, a creative partnership, and a business entrepreneur. And we have two people coming together. There is this sense of urgency or fast energy, fast communication. There is this offer. You feel like you have to do something right away or you have to make a rapid decision. Yes or no, right or left, what do I do? There is something here about independence and Page of Cups. So somebody could have money, it could be you, you could be wealthy or you could have a very successful business and somebody wants to partner with you. The challenge is there's something about the devil, restrictions on freedom, temptation, um, material world, issues, things in the material world, um, things that could be toxic or oppressive or taking away your, so it's like if you get an offer to partner up with someone, because it looks like there's a partnership, king and queen of coin, king and queen of fire, four of wands, you're kind of saying, I want to do things on my own. I want to stand my ground. I want to do things on my own. This person comes forward with a shock or a surprise. King of the water. With the three of the cups. Okay, we have something here about destiny. Okay. We, ha we have independence, standing on your own two feet. And then we have a water sign coming towards you with a message. Isis inspiration. Joy. What else for Aries? Aphrodite's love spell. Um, okay. Aphrodite's love spell. Okay, and then we have here romance. So somebody, it looks like a romantic message here. Somebody is coming towards you, telling you how they feel about you, expressing their feelings, wanting to get to know you, wanting to partner up with you. The root of the issue is you're very excited, you're going in a new direction. You're anticipating something great. What is going on here? Looks like a lot of really good positive energy. <laughs> because we've got the card of energy. This is about positive energy. Um, So, what else for Aries? Okay, I've got authenticity. Somebody is going to reveal or take off the mask and be authentic and real. Do you have a victory? Confidence and peace. Okay, so... Somebody's going to be real with you, tell you how they feel. Um, now, it could be romantic, it could be business, because it starts off with an ace of the coin. It stops, starts off with something real and authentic, something about a real development. What do we have here? The, the fox in the hen house and a soulmate. Somebody could be trying to steal your heart. 
bottom of the deck is a lot of love. Okay. What else? The house. Okay. The comforts of home. So we have here the tree of life and the nest. Bottom of the deck is observation, watching, looking very closely. Okay. Show us a couple more here for Aries for their daily message. Taking a chance. Time is of the essence. Somebody feels like time is running out. Travel, childhood fantasy, or someone's fantasy. And the Ten of Pentacles, a lot of money, a long term investment. The bouquet of flowers and the woman receiving the love. So we have something here about an offer of love. But on your mind is four of cups. It's like, I don't really want this or um, I don't want to change things right now. But this person comes in with deep feelings, Scorpio energy. They come in with deep feelings that they reveal whether this is business career or family. This is something about somebody revealing their deep feelings, wanting to see you, wanting to get together. There is a compromise and a negotiation. Um, it does bring you joy. Somebody could have been doing a love spell on you. That could be what this devil is. Like it could be a love spell. Somebody could have done some kind of love spell. There is a shock or a surprise. It's unexpected. Um, okay, I'm going to leave this here. Thank you, Aries, for watching. Take care.